there YouTube and welcome to lesson 26 of the Autodesk Maya 2017 training series and today we're going to look at how to animate attributes by using keyframes. So in order to do that what you have to do is you have to uh, create a shape just like this and then let's say let's create a sphere. And so far we have been animating the attributes like translate, y and so forth. So if I want to just add in keyframe to Y translate, for example, I don't just have to press S, but I can actually right click and keys, uh, do the key selected thing right there. And I can go to the frame that I want uh, and change the Y axis and right click and key selected. So what this does is it just adds in keyframe to that portion of the uh, of the uh, object that I have. So what I can do more is I can actually uh, animate more than just um, the position and the shape of the um, of the object. So I can, for instance, animate the opacity, the color as well. So in order to do that, what I can do is I can right click, let's say for example, I'm going to right click on this uh, and I'm going to assign new material to this. Okay, so right click, assign new material, and then I'm going to assign a blend to this. All right, there you go. So inside of blend, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select red. All right. So on the red, what I can do is I can right click on the color right here and just press set key. So if I go to the end and then change the color and do set key again, what it does is it actually transitions from red to blue, as you can see. So I can also add in transitions to colors, as you can see right there. So I can add an attribute to, I can actually animate everything that I see, every attribute that I see here. For example, I can attribute the uh, incandescent, I can uh, attribute the um, ambient color, the transparency, let's try transparency here. So I'm going to add a keyframe to transparency right here. I'm going to do set key, go over here, and then increase the transparency, set key, uh, decrease the transparency, uh, and then do set key and then increase the transparency and again set key. So what this does is it adds in keyframe, although you cannot see it here, it's a, it adds in keyframe to that um, attribute right there. So you, this is how you actually can uh, do a lot of animations. So you can just set key in all of the attributes that you see inside of Maya. So hope you guys learned something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.